Thank you for watching this video. Uh, this tutorial video is brought to you by NewQBO.com. NewQBO.com, your one-stop QuickBooks loan and share blog. So in this video, uh, we're going to talk about when I create an invoice, how do I get the packing slip to show the shipping address? So the uh, shipping address on your packing slip. Okay, so. Uh, I'm on QuickBooks Online uh, homepage screen here. Uh, let's open invoice in here, invoice form. As you can see here, you see billing address, but you don't see any shipping address. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to company gear, upper right corner, select settings, go to sales, and in here, is shipping under sales form content so you should uh, enable that one S check this box now it's on save it now I'll go back to invoice form again as you can see here now you see shipping address okay so in order to use the shipping address effectively so what you need to do is uh, first you need to have uh, shipping address on your uh, customer's detail page I'll select just this one any customer I'll select this one and uh, click edit once you click edit you want customer information page but if you're on transaction list you know you, you you know it's basically it's part of this you can go from here to customer details and click edit it will get to the same place Okay, as you can see here, this in this case, uh, billing address, same as shipping address. Let's say you want a different shipping address than billing address. You know, let's just put a uh, different address in here. Like this, and save it. So now I can uh, go to invoice and select customer right here. As you can see here, now you have uh, shipping address and uh, uh, billing, uh, billing, shipping address different than billing address now. So now you can create an invoice. Let's create an invoice in here. Let's say this one. Okay, the shipping uh, packing slip is right here. Packing slip is right here. So here's your packing slip. You have both billing address and shipping address right here you have quantity and everything you won't see uh, uh, rate or amount in here so that's the way uh, packing slips supposed to be and uh, in this case if you just want to show shipping address you can't do it right now you have to show both billing and shipping so uh, in case you just want to show shipping no billing then uh, it doesn't exist for now uh, so you know that's about it on this one and let's say you want to create the same uh, for the uh, for the for your sales receipt I'm gonna save this okay I'm gonna create sales receipt for the same customer okay as you can see here for sales to see, they don't have a packing slip. No packing slip for sales to see. So if you need packing slip for uh, sales to see, you need to send them uh, your feedback. So how to send feedback? All you have to do is upper right hand corner here, this one, and select feedback right here. And just uh, write down whatever you need to say. And then, you know, just uh, follow the instructions here. So that's how you send feedback, uh, any feedback, you know, any request. So this is what you need to do. 
So uh, you know how how to uh, create uh, uh, pack and sleep to show the shipping address now. Subscribe to our YouTube channels. We have two channels on YouTube: Wi-Fi Controller and New QBO. Like us on Facebook and visit our website. You can bookmark newqbo.com. Thank you again.